the UV ear, also called the uveal layer, uveal coat, uveal tract, or vascular tunic, is the pigmented middle of the three concentric layers that make up an eye. The name is possibly a reference to its reddish-blue or almost black color, wrinkled appearance and grape-like size and shape when stripped intact from a cadaveric eye. Its use as a technical term in anatomy and ophthalmology is relatively modern. Structure Regions The UVEA is the vascular middle layer of the eye. It is traditionally divided into three areas, from front to back, the iris, ciliary body, choroid, function. The prime functions of the uveal tract as a unit are nutrition and gas exchange. Uveal vessels directly perfuse the ciliary body and iris to support the metabolic needs, and indirectly supply diffusible nutrients to the outer retina, sclera, and lens, which lack any intrinsic blood supply. Light absorption. The UVE improved the contrast of the retinal image by reducing reflected light within the eye, and also absorbs outside light transmitted through the sclera, which is not fully opaque. Dot. In addition some uveal regions have special functions of great importance, including secretion of the aqueous humor by the ciliary processes, control of accommodation by the ciliary body, and optimization of retinal illumination by the iris's control over the pupil. Many of these functions are under the control of the autonomic nervous system. Pharmacology the pupil provides a visible example of the neural feedback control in the body. This is subserved by a balance between the antagonistic sympathetic and parasympathetic divisions of the autonomic nervous system. Informal pharmacological experiments have been performed on the pupil for centuries, since the pupil is readily visible, and its size can be readily altered by applying drugs, even crude plant extracts, to the Cornea. Pharmacological control over pupil size remains an important part of the treatment of somocular diseases. Drugs can also reduce the metabolically active process of secreting aqueous humor, which is important in treating both acute and chronic glaucoma. Immunology The normal UVEA consists of immune competent cells, particularly lymphocytes, and is prone to respond to inflammation by developing lymphocytic infiltrates. A rare disease called sympathetic ophthalmia may represent cross-reaction between the uveal and retinal antigens. Clinical significance, cuveritis, choroiditis, iritis, iridocyclitis, anterior uveritis, sympathetic ophthalmia, uveal melanoma.